I used to see this as Julia's final resting place. Now it's just where her body is buried. Guess I'll be buried here soon. This is home to neither of us. Just the place for others to come and remember what they used to know. seem a bit jumpy. It sounds crazy, I know, but I've been seeing things I can't explain. Horrible, twisted things. I'm not even sure how I got here. I'm never drinking that much again. Then why stick around? I think there was a woman with me. Maybe my wife or my girlfriend. I can't remember much. It's all so hazy. I... I think I'm waiting for her. You remember her here with you? I think so. She leaned in to kiss me. Then the next moment she's screaming and reaching out for me. Then water. So much water. I'm sure you'll see her again someday. Somewhere nicer than this. Thanks. Makes you miss the warmth of the police station, doesn't it? Your secret errand was to get a flashlight? Keep it down. I can't see you, and we're not talking to each other. Got it? This place is crawling with people. Don't want to know. Hey, we're still people. The book says that there's a murder that happened right here. All I see are dead leaves and mud. This can't be a dead end. I'm not already. What am I gonna do? Just leave it to me.
excuse me, but, uh, did you see the police investigation here a few weeks back? Not close up. I think there was something behind me, but I'm not sure. What do you know about the girl who washed up here? This thing floated down the river by her body. I think it ended up in the bushes over there. Missing. Maybe some combination of clues? dark in these bushes. Joy, I need your help getting something out of those bushes. Okay. Let's keep looking. Don't want to miss a clue. Put some of this stuff together? Wait a minute. There's something familiar about this. I need to get up river, find out how she died. Better tell Joy. Body washed up on shore, so she was murdered up river. But where? Miles of banks on both sides. Might as well be looking for a needle in a haystack of needles. Oh, genius. It'll be a needle stack. Crawling with ghosts. Wish we could just ask her, Sophia. Holy crap, maybe we can. That's that ghost that was watching me. Freaky girl wouldn't leave me alone. 
It's her. She's the one in the photo. <sighs> Damn it, stop doing that to me, will you? Wait, don't leave me here with... Did you see that? Yeah. She was talking about that. A small favor. Give her a chance. Hey, she can help you. all of us. Please? Did you hear that? Of course I heard that. Demons. Shit. be that hard. Then you get over here and try it. Okay. I know it's steel or iron or something. What's with all this crap? Crap? This is my great-grandfather's stuff from the war. It may look like crap because it's old, but it's amazing. Blood cake bayonets, gruesome letters about the war. I even had a sip from his old flask. It made me realize how soft people have gotten. Compared to what? Compared to men like him. Don't you see? Finding all this stuff was a sign that I should be the one to remind people. To make them choke on their own blood. Please don't tell me you went through with it. I had it all planned out, but I died before I could. Just one more day and I could have changed the world. Listen, whatever you think this is about, it's not. Your great-grandfather fought to stop wars, not inspire them. I just let it go and move on. If you don't understand, you're just a part of the problem.
Maybe I can help. Damn it. What's wrong with this thing? What do you mean? It seems to be doing its job just fine. Its job is to let people know who I was, and I was not like this. Not this filthy. I was important and rich and clean. I knew the importance of keeping up appearances, which is why this just won't do. It needs to look better than all the others. Not like the rest of these freaks. You'd be surprised. Did everyone hear that? This young lady just asked if this happened before or after the famous trials. It actually happened a few decades before. So this graveyard is quite old. Okay, and we're going to walk a little farther now. So if you'll just follow me. Come on, buddy. Leave the poor girl alone. Poor girl? <laughs> she and her investigative news team put me on death row. Now hold on a second. Whatever you did put you on death row, not her. Please, if it wasn't for her, they wouldn't have found out. You should have seen the pride in her eyes as they put the bag over my head and pumped me full of chemicals. She likes to pretend that it doesn't bother her like she's stronger than that, but I know it does. I can see it when she sleeps. So you're haunting her for the rest of her life? No, I'm waiting for her death. And I want a front row seat. Then we'll have a little talk. She brought this on herself. <laughs> <laughs> 